What's up, animal lovers? Uh, so, um, I think a few days ago it was, uh, I don't know if you heard about this, but an airplane crashed into a helicopter, or a helicopter crashed into an airplane, either way, and there was actually a video that surfaced later, I don't know, it looked like someone shot it from their phone or something, I don't know much about it. The point is, aircraft collision, and, uh, you know, I had, I, I had talked about aircraft collision one time because I made a video once, I don't think it's on my channel anymore, but I, I made it back before the, the rooster days, and basically, ow, kitty, basically, uh, I was bitching about why we don't have jetpacks or flying cars or some kind of, uh, PFD, I called it, personal flying device, you know, something that you get on, like a Segway style or anything, you know, why don't we have some kind of vehicle that flies? But the point is, in that video, you know, they, they I, I, I mentioned that, that people are scared because they figured, oh, if we're all flying all of a sudden, there's going to be too much shit flying around, people are going to crash into each other all the time in the air. And I was like, Dude, what? You don't even have to worry about that. I mean, you have a whole nother dimension in the air, and you have all this space. I mean, the chances of someone crashing into each other are very slim. But, as we found out, it's possible. It, it can happen. Which is why I came up with this system, which I had talked about at the time, you know, and... Uh, Right now, they use uh, uh, human uh, air traffic controllers, and humans are prone to error because, you know, 356 days a year, there's no planes even flying into each other or even close to each other. So these guys are sitting on their ass doing nothing, you know what I mean? And then the one day it happens, I mean, it's like, oh, I wasn't paying attention to that little thing. I didn't think they were going to fly into each other. So, it, anyways, human error is not good because people get killed. So, the system is basically computer controlled. You have all the planes and everything all talking to each other on like a ad hoc network. And they can all communicate up to, you know, a couple miles away or whatever because they're in the air. There's nothing in between. So, the signals go straight there. And basically, I mean, it's like dead simple. Basically, if there's any two planes that are going towards each other or going, you know, in the same, going to cross paths, and it's possible that that any plane, it, you know, it calculates it if these planes could possibly get close to each other or anything like that, all they do is the system alerts them. You know, each plane has the system alert them, says, oh, there, there's a plane coming from, you know, the southwest, and it's heading and you may cross paths in, you know, one minute from now or whatever. So it tells one plane, you raise your altitude. And it tells the other plane, lower your altitude. So guess what? All right, one goes up and one goes down. And guess what? Oh, they miss every time. They miss every time. It's like they're going away from each other. It's crazy. It's just like, it, it's just insane how they miss each other every time because they're, and, and both of them don't even have to do it. One could do it. And this is like, and you wouldn't run into that like hardly ever. Like what are the chances? But if you did start seeing a lot of traffic, say they did release the jet pack and everybody started getting them, everybody would be knowing what to do. It'd be like, lower your thing or there's one coming from this way and they're coming in your direction. And that's the thing about, you know, flying in planes and shit, people are usually just going straight where they're going. They just head straight there. So it's not like people are flying around crazy. It's not like cars, like, I don't know if you're going to turn or do this and that. I mean, you just go straight there. It's very simple. It's very straight, straightforward, you know? It just should be like, this wouldn't have happened if, you know, if the two planes knew of each other's existence and knew the direction they were heading, like, you know, sonar or something, they saw it, bloop, 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 and they were like, oh, I shouldn't head that way because there's something else coming, or go up, you know, or slow speed, let them pass. I mean, there's hundreds of, you know, possibilities of how to avoid that, but human error, 
fails us and you know going forward everybody knows there's going to be more planes in the air not less so we should really have a system for that a system which i invented i patented um i got the copyright um i sent it into uh you know i got i got it you know i invented it basically and stuff like that so I don't know, I should get credit for that or something. I, I should make money if they use that system, which I invented. Uh, because I don't like seeing planes crash into each other. Anyways, um. <laughs> kitty, 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 kitty. Oh, kitty, what are you doing, kitty? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, kitty? Uh, oh, biting his nails. Good kitty. Uh, peace.